Well, the time now is 644 on a crisp autumn morning. First day actually feeling like it out there. Got a Corey Duke living her best life over at the Oklahoma Heritage Farm in Ramona, where its fall festival is underway. Corey, what's going on out there? Uh, Travis, I can't remember the last time I've been this cold. It's great. It, it is totally fall. Joining me now is Clayton Ulrich. He is the co-owner co of Oklahoma Heritage Farms. Um, you guys have so much going on out here. You've put in a lot of hours to get everything set. Uh, just tell me what went into all this preparation. We start early in the spring planting the maize. We bale hay all summer to use for a lot of the props out here. And, the, and uh, we fought the weather all year this year just because it's been so wet. So. But that's what takes, it takes to put it all together. And uh, the viewers at home are going to see our Sky 2 drone showing aerials of your maze. And I know that with all of that recent flooding that we had, that corn, it wasn't easy to, it was, it was difficult. Uh, you guys had to do something different with the crop? Yes, we were, we were planted late. We actually planted twice to get it up. So that it, uh, that's, took two times to get it up, planting it, and then it flooded out the first time, and the second time we got it up. So. And speaking of that flooding, I know that a lot of farmers were devastated by that flooding. What are you guys doing to help? We're taking part of our proceeds and going to donate them to the, the Muskogee County Disaster Relief Committee, that, and, lot, and all that goes to farmers that was affected down south. And so, you know, it is fall. We think of fall, we think of pumpkins. With all that flooding, were the pumpkins impacted? They were. They were planted late. Some of them were rot when we were picking them because it was still so wet in the field. There were some of them that was rotten in the field just because of the wet ground and everything. Oh, man, so a lot of the crops saturated. Uh, I understand that you guys are getting pumpkins from Nebraska, but they're also experiencing a lot of rain right now. So how is that all working out? Well, they said they will have a load in here next week, but they uh, we talked to them yesterday and it was raining up there, so they, they're their pickings delayed up there, but we have enough that we grew here on the farm to get us by about two weeks. So. All right, Clayton. All right, not to worry. Plenty of pumpkins to go around. Coming up in just a little bit, you might notice this artillery that you see behind me. We're going to check it out and show you how that works. Send it back to you, Travis. Oh, man, Corey, I don't know if I trust you with a cannon. I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> I don't trust myself either. I don't trust myself either. You're very self-aware, <laughs> we'll Corey. Yeah, looking forward to it. Thanks so much.